Hi, I'm Bill Walker. Closet indexing is a charge that certainly can't be levied against my guest, Aaron Greenfield, whose go-anywhere investment approach and flexible mandate allows him to look very different than his benchmark. Aaron, before we begin, I believe congratulations are in order. You were recently uh, named lead manager of Trimark Global Balance Fund. Congratulations. Thank you. And you were also recently named to the CFA Institute's Corporate Disclosure Policy Council. So That's very right. good. Well done on both fronts. Thanks. Aaron, we're starting to see people buy foreign investments again. Uh, why is now a good time to move a portion of investors' money into foreign balanced or equity funds? Uh, I think it's always a good time to invest globally, uh, and there's many reasons for that. Um, you know, number one, uh, Canada only is really dominant in so many industries, and so if you have all of your wealth tied up in, in equities in Canada, you're going to be predominantly invested in just a few industries. So the, when you invest globally, you've got the opportunity to invest in a number of industries so you can really diversify nicely. Uh, but not just that, also just when, whenever you in, increase your uh, opportunity set, I think it, it increases your chance of outperformance. Um, so you get a uh, wider opportunity set, you get more industries, and also you can diversify your wealth by uh, currency as well. Um, so if you've got all your wealth tied up in, in, in Canada, then if the Canadian dollar uh, depreciates, you know, a lot of your, your purchasing power is going to go away. So this is a way of protecting your purchasing power as well. Aaron, it's been a little over three years now since you and Jeff Heyrich uh, assumed management of Trimark Global Balance Fund. Talk a little bit about why investors should buy Trimark Global Balance Fund. Well, I think it really comes down to we follow the tried and true Trimark discipline. Um, you know, it, if, you, if you look at our style, um, we're very focused on finding dominant companies that can grow we're looking for ethical management teams that have a, a good track record. Um, we're looking for companies that earn high returns on capital. We're, we're very uh, concentrated compared to our competitors. Um, we're not afraid to um, go where other people aren't, go off the beaten path, look in areas where other people aren't looking. Um, so, so I think it's, it really comes down to that philosophy of being a value investor, trying to buy stocks when they're cheap. You brought a lot of clarity to this. Thank you very much. Thanks a lot.